For this series, I will teach you on how to insert an electronic signature in our PNPKI form. Okay, so here is what Philippine National PKI application form looks like. But before we can edit or fill out all the necessary information or data needed in this form, we need to open this one through an Adobe Acrobat Reader. But if you don't have this application or software yet, all you need to do is go to your Google Chrome browser and then simply type Adobe Acrobat Reader in the search engine and then see Adobe Acrobat Reader DC installed for all versions. There are two options, Adobe Acrobat Reader DC which is 184 MB and Adobe Acrobat Pro DC 909 MB. So this one below is for trial only and we will select or choose the one that is for free so simply click on the download button here on top and then wait for it to begin downloading so i already have my adobe acrobat reader installed in this computer but for this tutorial i will show you how to download and install it again now here below you can see it we already downloaded the file so all we need to do is click on this and Click open. So, do you want to allow this application to make changes to your device? Yes or no? Of course, you will select yes. Then right after, the installation will begin. But as what I've said a while ago that I already have this installed in my computer so we will just click finish. Then you will be directed now to the application so you can click open file here for you to browse on the application form or in the recent you can see here the application form already here is now our pnpki application form so again you need to have your photo affixed in this form first and fill out all the necessary data needed and then right at the bottom of course you need to affix also your e-signature so how to do it you just simply click on the signature box and then browse for your signature Here is now your e-signature but there are instances wherein the signature box will look like a black box only so how to fix this all we need to do is go to that picture and then right click choose edit file and you will be directed to the paint application all we need to do is click on the file then save us rename it into whatever um, the file name you want so say you have picture 002 save and then ok close the application then go back to the application form now click on the signature box again and then click browse then in the desktop, we save picture 002, click open, and here it is. So that's it. So if you learned something from this video, I hope you give this a like or a thumbs up and share this one to your friends for them to learn also. Thank you and God bless.